Hi, um, I'm Phil from <coughs> sorry April Coon Productions. Um, I put up a pano yesterday, and I was talking about using this handle for um, launching and retrieving the drone. It's quite a simple um, thing. It, it it came with a thing for holding your phone. I can't quite see why you would want to stick your phone on top of the drone, <clears throat> but it, uh, it it seemed ideal if I took that bit off to uh, use it as a handle for launching the drone. So um, I've got the drone all ready. Um, so I'm going to put this on the drone. It's quite easy. Um, undo the thing. It's a bit like it's a bit like a um, GoPro thing and you can open it out like this to, to get it on so here we go let's uh, put it on it just goes on over the over the top and and you want it sort of positioned roughly around where the the knobs are for taking the battery off um, you don't want to interrupt the um, sensors for for downward vision. This bit's a bit fiddly, just getting the screw in to tighten it up. So there we have it fixed on the on the M2. Mavic 2. So I'm going to stand over here. I've got my um, controller all ready to go. Take off, slide across, and away it goes. Bring it back down again. Grab hold of it and bring the you know the the controller for down for bringing it down and it lands as if it's in your hand. That's pretty simple. Once more. There we go. Very simple. So I'm going to switch it off. Don't want to cut my fingers off. There we go, it's gone off. Just a couple of other things I might as well show you. I've got leg extenders, front and back, and I've put these um, Cree LEDs on the, on the back, which are really quite bright. I won't bother with the other one. You can recharge these with a USB cable. And I put a black skin on the bottom and a nice fancy coloured one on the top so I can see it in the grass or whatever. There you go. This is my um, control setup. I've got a, a 7 and 7.85 Crystal Skies screen um, with a aluminium holder or, or mount rather and which goes on to the controller it's nicely balanced um, got a cable from the side into the side of the uh, controller so there you go it's quite easy I think if I was doing this on a on a I'd, I'd put a lanyard on it so that it's sort of hanging on me you know wouldn't want to risk dropping it. Okay, that's it.